Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge and Prince William stepped out in the blistering sun yesterday to join the Queen in a lavish garden party at Buckingham Palace. Kate looked stunning in a summery pink Alexander McQueen dress, shielding herself from the sun in a matching Juliet Botterill hat. Prince William looked dashing in a black blazer, red tie and grey trousers, accessorizing his look with a brown cane. The Queen, pictured walking in front of the royal couple, dressed in a pastel blue Stuart Parvin dress coat and Rachel Trevor Morgan hat. Royal correspondent Richard Palmer said, the Duke accompanied by the Duchess of Cambridge, who is wearing Alexander McQueen and a Juliet Botterill hat, have joined the Queen and other members of the royal family at a Buckingham Palace garden party. The Queen is in Stuart Parvin and a Rachel Trevor Morgan hat. Around 8,000 people are attending the Queen's annual garden party held at Buckingham Palace. With regards to the dress code, men wear morning dress or lounge suits while women wear day dresses, usually paired with hats or fascinators. Guests are strongly encouraged to arrive on foot or use public transport when arriving to the venue. Entrances to the garden were open at yesterday at 2.30 p.m., with guests arriving through gates at Hyde Park Corner and the Grosvenor Gate on Lower Grosvenor Place, while the main entrance to Buckingham Palace opened at 3 p.m. The Queen will welcome more than 30,000 to the grounds of Buckingham Palace and the Palace of Holyrood House this summer. Around 27,000 cups of tea, 20,000 sandwiches and 20,000 slices of cake are consumed at royal garden parties every year. The Queen hosts up to three garden parties at Buckingham Palace every summer. The first party fell on May 15th, and the next ones will be held on May 21st and May 29th which will also be held at Buckingham Palace. The final one will take place on July 3rd at the Palace of Holyrood House. The Queen will be represented by her son, Prince Charles, at the garden party.